Are you recording? Yes, I am. All right. Uh, welcome back, everyone. I'm sure y'all enjoyed our previous episode of One Piece Review, this new series that we have started on the Goody channel. Yep. Very true. Uh, last time we reviewed Romance Dawn arc. A great arc, great arc. But we may have an even better arc in the Orange Town arc, mm -hmm. where we are introduced to not only Nami, but Crispus Attucks. Oh, yeah. In the Boston Massacre. The Boston Massacre, in fact, happened in Orangetown, not in Boston. Uh, yeah, I also just realized how much orange uh, Buggy the Clown wears, so it was a kind of a bit of a uh, foreplay, you know? Yeah, yeah. Alright, shall we continue? Yep. <laughs> so, uh, uh, Luffy gets stuck in a cage, unfortunately, uh, as you can see here. Um, uh, you know, you think logically he'd just, you know, uh, squeeze out, but, you know, he's Luffy, so he can't. Uh, it's not looking good for Luffy, let me tell you. Um, he, uh, meets this dog in a cage. We'll get to more, we'll get to that, uh, a little bit later, but he also meets this mayor guy named, uh, Boodle. Um, he kind of carried the arc, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, him and along with Hotshell Ray, they, uh, kind of tag-teamed mm -hmm. Buggy. And it's sad, y'all. Well, the, the story of the dog's kind of sad, y'all, but also, yeah. Oh, very sorry. Yeah, yeah the, the dog, yeah. the dog's yeah. owner um, got killed. Yeah, we'll get to more of that later, yeah. though. Yeah, but yeah. We, we don't like the dog, though. Yeah, well... Uh, sad, sad story, but the dog is annoying. Yeah, I'll turn it over to right. uh, uh, Kojiri and uh, Javel. Yep. All right, so Zoro is very, very cool in this arc. So at first... Zoro actually gets defeated by the great Captain Buggy, as Captain Buggy is a direct counter using his Chop Chop Fruit, which allows for him to like be invincible to swords, Scary. which is Zoro's primary weapon. So we're like, uh oh, what's gonna happen? Not very good, y'all. So, good. but then, but then we we meet one of uh, Buggy's henchmen, Kabaji, who is very very annoying. Man rides a unicycle. We'll we'll get to more of him later. And he is well. also a swordsman, and Zoro kind of destroys his ass, and it's pretty sick. Mm -hmm. So yeah, he does cool attacks also to win the fight. Tadashi. And so Javel McGee is honestly kind of a Zoro with the, his axe. They're both 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 wielding blades. They're both the same. Mm -hmm. so and then yeah, Big Hero Six. Uh, you mean Tadashi Yamada, who was actually in the mm -hmm. arc. Um, he was the dog. Yep. He was the uh, the dog's owner, actually. Uh, and yeah. then he also tried to save Crispus Attucks, but and he failed to do so. Yeah, unfortunately. So you, you know, uh, you can see he has this uh, this aura of uh, spunk and kind of swag. You know, as he's leaning to the side. You know, you can tell that he's a confident guy. Um, yep. How about the the Nuggets, y'all? Uh, the Nuggets, they're pretty good. Uh, speaking of. <laughs> So we got Nami. Yeah, we got Nami. M equals Nami, actually, uh, which is... Uh, uh, Nami is a greedy bitch. No one likes Nami. No one wants her there. And that's pretty much all I got to say about Nami. Um, she sucks. Was this your slide? Yeah. No, it wasn't. How about you uh, stick to your slide next time, okay? What? You literally did... Oh. Oops. So I thought... Anyway. I... Oh, yeah. No. Like yeah, I you're was right. saying... Um... Made me lose my train of thought. What is wrong with you? Anyway, I summed it up here. You can have the next one. Anyway. <laughs> Buggy crew. Uh, we hate them. We really do. Um, three pirates um, mainly are in the crew. That uh, These are like the top dogs. They're in the bottom right, actually. Uh, these top dogs, um, yeah, I think they resembled the uh, far right one off of Kojiri. I could be wrong though. Uh, you never know with the I think you are. Tony yeah. animations, but uh, uh, top right is the more uh, the uh, the lookers in the uh, the group. Uh, they have great attire on. They they dress to impress, you know. And then uh, yeah. to the left is uh, uh, Kabaji from uh, Roblox Studios. Um, he's a big fan of that, um, and it's a fest. And, uh, there's... uh, no, yep, it's a giggle fest. Yeah. Oh, giggle fest, okay. The three port, three pirate guys are kind of a giggle fest. And then, uh, but... dumb line guy. Also exists, yeah. but he's so dumb, we're not even gonna mention him. Uh, so, before we get to stupid dog, I just got a little bit of a comparison I'd like to make. 
Luffy in the cage kind of resembles Aaron Rodgers stuck in Green Bay. That is true. That he is a... really wants to get out, but he just cannot get out of Green Bay. And, and I also think that right. um, the uh, the pirates of Buggy's crew actually um, resemble cheeseheads of Wisconsin, you know, because mm, they really yeah. want him to stay. And Buggy is maybe like the... Um, the oh, he's like Matt LaFleur. Coach. Yeah, Matt LaFleur, yeah. Of... And, kind of the, powerful. and the uh, crew members are the, the cheese heads around Wisconsin. So great analogy. Yep. 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 Uh, you can go ahead and do uh, stupid so dog. Stupid dog doesn't just doesn't shut up. He's just annoying as fuck. Sounds like a human. Yeah. Uh, I don't care about his backstory. I mean, it's kind of sad when you learn it, but like, dog is too annoying for me to care, really. Yeah, that's all I got to say about the dog. Almost annoying as Nami, but not quite. Yeah. Fuck that dog. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Good. Good. Also, yeah. Uh. Uh. Bith needs. Bith needs very important stuff. Um. Oh, hair, air. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay, Kojiri. Uh, I'd like to take it. Away. I'd like you to take it away for your thoughts. Oh yeah. Okay. So good arc, y'all. Pretty. Pretty. It's a game changer. Uh. We actually get to learn about our second devil fruit in this. And we learned that devil fruits are kind of a big deal around wow, what here. What devil fruit is it? So we learned about the chop chop fruit that Buggy accidentally eats. Wow, what does from, it do? Uh, while, while being on the hold up, while being on the ship on black on Whitebeard ship with the Shanks that who we met in Roman Stone Arc, if you remember correctly from our previous review. A little a little connection there between our reviews. Uh but so the chop chop fruit allows buggy's body to disassociate and like fly almost like his hands could fly and his legs can fly it's pretty cool but it's kind of a it's nowhere near powerful as the gama 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 fruit or buggy doesn't utilize it as well as luffy does with the gama gama fruit but nonetheless still a cool still a cool devil fruit that we also learned that there are many more out there uh, like I've said in previous slides, I hate the dog. I still do. Uh, Luffy can fight with great power as we see Luffy take down the great, uh, Buggy, the clown. And Buggy, Buggy will be back, I think. I'm just, just a little hunch I've got. Yeah, I was also, uh, I was also sensing a little bit of Chew foreshadowing as well. Yeah, yeah. I think so too. Uh, I, I hate Nami more than the dog. And also, uh, the One Piece animators going ahead with getting Eiffel 65 to do the soundtrack for the Orange Town arc was a great, great idea. Uh, when Blue played during the, the Buggy and Luffy fight, I uh, was getting really hyped. And then, my favorite part, though, was when Paul Revere did warn the British that the British were coming in Orange Town. That also happened. Awesome. It did happen. Uh, I watched the episode where it happened. And he also exposes myths about the American Revolution in in the arc. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Alright, so uh my thoughts overall. Uh Boodle basically carried uh he just had an aura around him in which uh, you could tell he was the type of guy to take charge um, and in command when fighting uh, the buggy and his pirates. Um, it kind of reminded me of Knights of the Round Table, the way they gathered together and uh, took out Buggy and his com uh, comrades. Uh, really inspiring stuff, uh, hence the picture of the round table. Uh, Kabaji is the worst human on planet Earth. Uh, that goes without saying, honestly, because... Uh, he fights dirty. Um, he's kind of like Morgs in a sense, um, where uh, Morgs just likes to uh, play the YouTube uh, drama and uh, play the um, the uh, you know play YouTube itself and its viewers. And uh, unfortunately, yeah. that's uh, today's landscape, um, similar to how Kabaji cheats in his duel with uh, Zoro. Uh, we threw trees from Yonder Glen. Um, also pretty self-explanatory. Uh, they're basically the th the three uh, pirates that Zoro beats up on a boat. The poor guys, long noses, uh, kind of outcasts. Oh, getting, getting, but yeah, their only weapons are the apples. Kind of sucks. Yeah, 
but it's okay They'll have, because they yeah. get, they get to sing and you know uh, Greg Heffley is uh, the leader of the bunch so you know yeah uh, when Ro- and then Roderick ex- kind of exposes them yeah just like Zorro does too yeah and then uh, my final question for the viewers today is why is it called Orange Town uh, you may uh, they may have answered this um, in the arc I probably didn't listen to it i think uh, it has it could to be do. it could be with uh the color of buggies uh, uh just you know or sorry I, it wouldn't be because of that it just like have some resemblance to buggies i think clothing. it kind of has to do with orange theory fitness we oh, see one of the stores in that's true the art that's true uh yes and speaking of which uh this is the average uh orange theory fitness member. oh and then also if you use code Kojiri Spoody One Piece reviews at oh, Orange or, Theory. 07, if you go 07, to your local 07. Orange Theory, don't forget 07. If you go to your local Orange Theory and tell them that we brought uh, Orange Town brought you there, then you'll get a free cycle with Jack McDonald. Yep. Yep. All right. Look up. Nice. Thank you for watching, everyone. Uh, be on the lookout for James Harden in the next video. Yes. Uh, also, the new uh, Lego Scooby Doo game gonna be a fun, uh, fun time. Uh, Toy Story Three has been out for multiple years. You guys should definitely. Also, to try. tomorrow, tomorrow, count, set your alarms. Yep. For RuneScape Part One. Oh. RuneScape Part 1 uh, probably won't be coming out because I think I deleted the footage. Um, so, uh, also, top right, uh, it's really, you know, really cool. Um, uh, yeah. And then uh, there's a butter knife uh, down the bottom right because um, this is a very smooth transition um, from getting one crewmate to the next, you know? So. Thank you all for watching. Um... And have an awesome, awesome, and, awesome yeah. day. Hi, McManus. He's definitely not watching the video all the way through. Yeah.